What is it? It's uh, supposedly slasher and Asian being dropped for beans and pentagram. Now you, now you tell me. Now you tell me that's I not. I got cooked. more intel. Well, 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 intel? Well, well, my chat was also saying coaching change. It's supposed to be coaching uh, change. Hey. I mean, the coaching change, change, the coaching hold, change, I don't mind. Like, it's hold, just, whatever. Tom, hold on. Someone in your chat said, get Zinni the fuck out, and he's not a sub, so I banned him. Yeah, All right, good, good place, good place. All right, so as, <laughs> as, as, as you were saying? What's your Scrappy <laughs> intel, Tom? Uh, I just asked him if, how did you know it was Scrappy? Because he said fucking check Yeah, he said text. check text. <laughs> okay, he said he doesn't give a fuck. All right, he said, gunless and Dak to Minnesota. Yeah, that one's already been kind of reported. If Dak doesn't get the Minnesota spot, then 4 will get it. The hell? Okay, and well, if Dak gets to Seattle. Minnesota, then 04 will go to Seattle. Okay, so we know where Dak's number one choice is. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay, wait, okay, wait, so, wait so, re so, so 04 is going to Rocker or Seattle? Yeah, it's on Dak, basically. I'm guessing. I'm guessing it's, it's on Wait, uh, it's on it's Dak on... or it's on whoever they pick? Uh, I don't know. I think it's on whoever they pick. It sounds like they're going to trial people. So wait, Pierce is, a, is Pierce 100% like then? Is 100%. So then who's the, other who's the other person who's the other person getting dropped on Rocker then? What do you mean? Wait, so so Awakening is getting dropped for right now people are saying Pierce? I mean, then, if if two of them are getting dropped, so uh, Lamar one's getting Awakening, drops? no, they need their 04. I hope to God Lamar's not getting dropped. If Lamar I mean, got either, dropped, they're dropping a Reese. Listen, it's either Lamar or Vivid because there is a rumor that Vivid's going to an AR. They said that. Maybe right, Big P main, on this Vivid Ross flexing. Right and maybe they're going to have Big P main, Vivid flex, and have uh, Dak and Linz as the subs. Maybe that's what they're thinking. Maybe that's that's where they're going with it. We are just we are just rolling the dice. Actually, okay. I don't I don't actually hate these changes. Hold on, I want to talk about Boston again. Wait, yeah, they were saying Boston. Boston coaching change. Someone was saying. Yeah, they did. Yeah. They're picking up their challengers coach, Tony. They're picking up their challengers coach. They're dropping slasher and an Asim apparently, and they're okay. picking up pentagram and beans. Dude, see Boston, Boston. I feel like is the toughest team to make changes because they all took turns being dog shit. One game, someone pops off. Yeah. The next, he's dog shit. Like there was no actual consistent player. Not. Not a single one of the four were like incredibly consistent. I would say Priest are probably at the best major, but yeah, granted, but, that, they, but I mean, the, probably, the, the sample point, size just, is so small. At that point, you just look at their intangibles, bro. Like, you got to make a team, bro. You can't just make like four people that like just literally are going to shoot the gun. Like, I got more intel. I mean, honestly, oh, it sounds, I mean, it sounds like they're going I for energy. It it, I mean, yeah. it, it sounds like they're going for energy because. Beans compared to Slasher, it's like intangibles. I feel like Slasher is probably a better leader when it comes to like teaching how to play the game. Beans is going to bring more hype and like amp up the young guns more, though. You're going to tell me that ASIM doesn't Jetty, bring any sort of energy. Jetty, welcome back for 14. Like... Thank you. Uh, I mean, okay, like, Tom. Oh, Tom's got intel. Not like Beans does, no. Go ahead. Well, that's it. Beans we is an error, though. We have, a, we have a development. Ladies and gentlemen, there has been another development. There has right. been another development. Seattle Surge, apparently, Brezzy. He's being dropped for the one and only Nicola, a.k.a. Nikki D. Really? Nikki D. Go back to Seattle? W no move. Shot. W that's move. That's what I'm hearing. No that's shot. What I'm Nick, hearing. Nick is going back to Seattle? W that's move. What I'm hearing, bro. That's what oh, I'm hearing. Oh, no. W move. Sorry to Brezzy. You're leaking everything. If you got intel, text me. I'm leaking it all. What? We can ask Nick. I don't give a fuck <laughs> anymore. I don't give a fuck. The one thing leaked it first. Tactical Rabs got a hard on. Oh my god, we're just, leaking, we're just leaking everything. Why am I fucking... being fucking blamed for everything? <laughs> you started this. You started this shit. Well, I'm good. This. Well, good, because these guys well, are horrible. Once you open the door, once you open the door, I'm walking in. Wait, Nick actually played yeah, pretty Nick actually played pretty good this weekend. Yeah, he anyway. played good. He yeah. played good in the Challenger tournament. But... Bro, if people are gonna make dog shit decisions, I'm gonna leak them, bro. Like, I'm sorry. Like, listen, dude, you bro, gotta do better than no, this. Listen. Shit. I'm done. I mean, they I mean no, tweeted. listen. Okay, let, let, let's are you bugging? Though, are you bugging about Asim getting dropped? Me? Yes. Well, well, yes. listen. Well, 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 <laughs> yes. well, well. I get it, but Boston is probably just trying to make Snoopy like their young gun, long term. Like, I don't care. Hopefully, I don't care. Transition him happening. into a superstar. Okay. Yeah, it's not happening. That's Talk what they're trying up. to do. So that's why it's probably Snoopy it's staying over Asim. Chalk it up. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest though. People talking about leaks, like the rotation or scrim intel or city intel would have tweeted this out eventually because I was getting that text message from a lot of people, bro. The the the, the word was out. The That's word a fair was point. Out, so. If Vinny it, knows, if Vinny knows, all challengers like, team probably knows. Like like Tony, you remember how you said, "Oh, you're scumbags." Well, here's the thing, right? 
If I was joking, it, just just from the same page. If we don't do it, rotation's gonna do it. Scrimento's gonna do it. CDO Intel's gonna do it. They're all gonna You're do it wrong. anyway. So we is, might as is well Nick, just is Nick talk actually about it. going to Seattle or is that bullshit? That'd I be, don't know. It's... So so Seattle will be Kyler and, and Nikki D teaming back up again. The duo running the back. You have a yeah, Booza, yeah. and yeah, then and, who's and the fourth? Wait, my source just came in about Nikki D. My source what? just came in. What did he say? He responded back, LOL, I'm crying. I was just trolling you. Oh, oh what shit. the hell? Uh, and my source, ladies and gentlemen, was the one and only long neck Scrappy. So we no, can all you got set up. Rappy. You got set up. So we can all put LaRappy in the chat. Up, L Rappy. Bro. We can all put L Rappy in the chat. I was going to say, chat, that Nick shit was too good to be true, bro. Nah, bro, I wish they true. brought Nick back to Seattle. They should bring Nick back. Why are you guys spamming Luma? He, I do think... He was the one who fucking texted you got, me. You got Listen, I do, think, I do think Seattle needs more than a one-person change. And 100% agree. Respectfully, I think you keep a booze and Kyler over Brezzy, and if Brezzy is kept, I call Rambo French cheese. French cheese. I have to say, I'm, uh, if, if Brezzy is kept over Kyler and a booze, I'm calling Rambo French cheese. I mean, the only thing the team is Swiss cheese because they can't win respawns. A good one. Oh, I wish I had my soundboard. It's a good one, Ben. It's a good yeah, one. No problem. But like, I mean, I agree with you. I think this is a two-person change situation for Seattle because it's not even. It's, respawn. It's, it's, it's not even like Brezzy's yeah. fault, but it's like I I, I think Abuza show more promise. You don't drop Kyler from that team. Put Abuza in his and actual good And one player role, is not going to change everything. Put a booze in the role that he was excelling in last year. Guys, I'm not sure what's like... going on with Illy, man. Everyone's saying Illy did he vanish. I truly don't know what the fuck's going I mean, on with anyway. Illy. Like, I wish, I, I wish we had actual information on that. The only people that know, I think, are the team and him. And his yeah, family, I don't think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think. Like, I don't think anybody it's, in the it's, community even knows. Got involved, bro. Just know that. All right. Mm-hmm. Yeah, L Reader. That's all I'm gonna say. Why are they all spamming L Reader, bro? Well, what's being? What? What am I not reading? What is going on? Flank tweet. Everybody's saying flank tweet. Look at my phone. We have the Nikki D shit. Did they actually? Well, that's gonna yeah. be deleted now. Cause they. Welcome back to the league. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Nikki D probably <laughs> looking at this like, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck is going on? We should probably delete that shit now. Yo, Zin. Just crap. What's wrong with you, bro? Yo, where's Zin at? <laughs> fuck, he called me weave for the fat fuck. <laughs> oh shit. Jesus. Mm. Oh Jesus Christ. Did he oh, step Jesus away. Well, some real cod timing going on. As a curly fat person, I take offense. Okay, yeah, so you right had now. me fucking crying. Holy Yo, shit. Yo, what up, Ern? What up, fat ass? <laughs> okay, don't call me fat, you stupid like, you're calling me soft weird. fuck. You're calling me weird. Why am I calling you weird? I don't know. What are you calling me weird for? I didn't call you weird. Five out of champs. Did. I mean, two for 56, oh, less than a 2% win percentage. Rich as fuck. Yeah, I read the top comment on hey. Reddit. This hey. guy said, Beans, P-Dog, Penta, and Snoopy. Oh, brother, these guys are cooked. Boston fans, I'm so sorry. Thoughts on the roster. First comment, I'm out. I follow <laughs> Little Coat, and that's it. I wish nothing but failure on those <laughs> guys. Crazy. Jesus Christ. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, Dude, that's actually insane. What's up, Aaron? I got Cactus Club. Cactus Club is a good that's shit. That's fucking crazy. What, what is Cactus Club? It's uh, like a it's like a Toronto restaurant. Okay, That's okay. fucking insane, guys. Well, that's a good restaurant to come to if you come here. Beans, oh, wow. Priest, I'm, I'm Pentagram, and Snoopy. Two months. I'll be back if there's more developments. Right, I don't know, man. I don't know how I feel about the boss. I mean, I'm glad it's Boston ass, changed. I'm glad, well, listen, you guys are also ASIM G. So ASIM could get dropped from Atlanta phase and you right. guys would be upset. After I'm you sit here with a straight face and I like ASIM hasn't been their best player. ASIM Seriously. is very... I'm, no, no, I hate I'm not, friendship cheese. It is true, though. It's true. Cheese. It's true. But it's bullshit. That's no. Bullshit. No, it's not. He's good as fuck. Okay, but if he got dropped from Atlanta phase, you'd be like, he didn't deserve Brother, that. He played one event, played great. I'm and not. He was a good and and he was a good teammate. And I'm hearing that there were certain people on the team showing up late for practice, not going hard. Okay, that's okay. That's you different have shit. Going hard as fuck every day, performing. I would have kept Asim personally. What I, do you want him I, to do? I would have kept Asim. Okay, I would do so Asim. Why are you saying friendship cheese? Because I'm just friendship cheese. Well, I'm just saying you guys would like blow the fuck out of it because it's Asim. No, bro, bro, bro. If Asim was getting shit on. We would just have to be realistic and be like, bro, Asim was struggling and he got fucking dropped. We would just have to be realistic. Yeah, but like, I don't think like, the way I see it, like if Boston's making that change, they have reasons. It's not like a personal thing. No one personally dislikes Asim. Do you, so do it's you like trust they had to, have... to make roster changes though? When have they made? I trust Dens. I do. I mean, I used to I play mean, there. Well... I mean, fair, but like, when have they made a roster change that's resulted in them? I think, bro, like, playing better than they were playing I think, before. I think they're just trying to, like, I feel like they're trying to see if there's like 
more they can get out of Snoopy to like try and transform him because obviously what, he's, he's is, talented is, as fuck. He needs to so be smarter. Fair, but what is bringing in Pentagram in for his first ever league spot, league shot, and bringing in Ben Beans, who love love Ben. Ben's a great SD player. Yeah. Respawn, I think he's he's played some pretty decent this year, but Ben's also not like Sam Octane, like human UAV communicator. <laughs> so now you're putting like a lot of pressure, and we know that Snoop is not the greatest calling out either. So now you're putting so much pressure on Preston to not only be like your gap finder, your like role player, but also to be like your community, big communicator, like in-game leader. Like, well, not Priest. Well, 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 yeah, no. Well, now Priest needs to, to be. Now. Yeah, what's good, Mark? Well, yeah. Well, I mean, Preston. So much on his shoulders now. Wait, you're saying Preston has so much he needs to play as a role player and get kills? Is that what you're saying? No, no. I'm saying Preston, like, bro, look at the communication of the team now. Like, I love Ben. You know, I, I watch Team War scrim every, mostly every morning when they're <laughs> no, stuff. Beans is in here. Yeah, the yeah Beans is in here. in here. And like, and like, listen, Ben's <laughs> actually, Ben's, across all three game modes this year, Ben's played yeah. pretty good. Like, I know the player year, card say? He's good at SND respawn, whatever. Ah, Ben's good. He's no. been good. He's been good. The issue with, listen, the issue just, with Boston is I genuinely. I'm not going to solve Snoopy's comms though. Like, how does this, how does this solve that problem? It's not like Austin and Asim about comms. Well, that's why I'm confused as to how Boston even made a decision because I think all four players took turns getting shit on or playing really well. I mean, I that's just my think point. I, I don't think I don't think Asim was like monumentally the most uh, consistent player on the team. I think you guys are tripping if you're saying that. A Asim had some crazy maps, and I wouldn't have dropped Asim, but like there were there is not a single player on that team that should have been safe. Tony, if I'm being honest, the whole team had their moments of getting shit on their, their whole team dynamic. Is That's off. what I'm saying. I'm saying like there was no like way they're to like, yeah, but how, terrible. Does, that, they're, how they, does this fix the team dynamic? This their is your weird were team. Terrible. Their, their, their teamwork was terrible. Yeah. Was, there was a lot of things. That's the whole point. Make a team that has. A well, the good thing. OK, well, well, I don't know Make about Pentagram. I know nothing well about him. I'm not sure if his comms are good, to be honest. I'm not sure if anybody knows if anybody has challengers experience and can speak, speak on behalf of Pentagram. That'd be good. I know what Beans brings. I think Beans brings, like, an energy that they kind of need. Because, I mean, Ace, I guess, brought energy, but not like Beans. Well, I mean, Beans is screaming, get everybody well, hype. It? Beans what is also more of a do? raw slayer. Like, Austin's like a... Austin can slay, but he wasn't, like, super consistent in the slaying. And Beans is, like, really good at just, like, roaming and getting kills. Well, I'll say this about the Austin change. Like, BR, welcome back, bro. Thank in. you. Layton. Uh, Layton. Game, Adi, though, welcome back, too. Thanks. I think in this game, was probably control. I think statistically, might actually be a little better... It totally was an S and D, but like watching them play, like that was definitely the one game mode. You know, I just think they're struggling in it. Maybe you that's guys are looking at as like because that was like one game mode. They were really so, they were terrible at control this last split. Like really, I don't really care bad. about fucking energy, bro. I just want them to have a good team with a good comp that actually play well off each other. Good well, trades, good good teamwork, good communication. Good, bro. I want a team that knows how to play. This, this is why I and thought I don't they know would getting go. rid of Austin was it was a good idea for that either. Well, that's the problem. Who do you get rid of? See that, that that's that's what I'm trying to get at. Is who does like how how do you decide? Like Austin's literally one of the best Call of Duty players ever. Especially, like, they're so bad at search, and Austin has always been I one think, of the best search players. I think when you when you have to make the decision on who this is, who you decide to actually drop, it has to be who's making the most mistakes, bro? Who's causing the most problems? Who 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 would you guys say is that is is that person on the team? For who who do you think has made the most mistakes, caused the most problems for the squad? I don't do know think? because it's a search issue. I think they were so bad at search. I don't think their respawn was that bad. It wasn't good, but like their no, search I, I was know, that I know bad. For a fact, I know. I'll, I'll say this, Tom, because I don't give a Yo, shit. Yo, Tree, welcome back. I know for a thank fact you. that there was definitely players in the team that were just completely and utterly blowing play calls in S and D, just blatantly like. Multiple what do you mean? Times a map. What do you mean? Like not listening to play calls? No, like listening to play call and just completely forgetting to set play call. Okay, so like these are things that we That's don't know. I'm saying, I'm saying from the Tom's public play, eye, like, it's, just, it's like I understand. We're just not seeing strats, bro. Like, like, I, I like you guys are saying, Asim like didn't deserve to be dropped, and I actually I agree. I would have kept Asim in some role. I would have changed the role. I I would have kept Asim. I think Asim's valuable. It just came down to the two SMGs, and they're trying to make Snoopy like their next franchise superstar because they see it in him. I understand that right now we a, may not see it. Like what I'm saying is, no, like, I Snoop, I get that. Snoopy's definitely got a lot of potential to but, be a really but, good player. But here's he's, the issue: he's got a Snoop, snap on him for Snoop, sure. Snoop has gun skill, but this isn't like the equivalent situation is like what New York did with Paco, because Paco obviously took a a while to come around into what he was playing. But when Paco came in, he was like takeover guy every map. Like Snoop has been good, but he's not been he's not been playing good enough. Paco in also matches, came in in the high Paco came in in the high TTK game where it's easier to individually Paco shine. Paco also didn't know fucking English. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like English. they were working around those issues. That's the equivalent situation. Cause I think 
Look, listen, I want to give Snoop the benefit of the doubt. Like, I mean, look, no, I think I, like, I do think Shotzi is the know? best. I, I think Shotzi is the best uh, person to bring up. Like, just because obviously Shotzi was a known variable where he shined in Halo. But when Shotzi came over, first and foremost, he was put on a better team than Snoopy was put on. If you compare what teams they were put on in their first season, yeah. yeah. So and and Shotzi also struggled in, in the kill column. He was yeah, not but finding they, they kills, but but it was on, obvious man. that he was. Had, I'm trophy, not done. They put on a trophy oh. smoke, bro. They put an on a trophy smoke. In Modern Warfare 2019, like what Shot, are we doing, yeah, bro? Smoke <laughs> but bro, but all I'm saying is, like, you can still see mechanically that Shotzi had it, but he didn't like. Like, you could be saying the same things about, like, first season Shotzi that you're saying about Snoopy right now. It's like, he's really good mechanically. He hasn't figured it out yet. Like, do you get what I'm saying? Like, I feel like he's the best they're, person. They're, to, they're, 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 they're believing in him. They're believing but, in him. Here's the issues. And, like, I get what I, you're I, I'm going to bring up another player, for example, to talk about. Talk about. Like, I love Nero. Nero's got great gun skill. You've seen in so many maps this year. He gets up a hard start. He just gets going. But, yeah. like, this year, you cannot scam decisions in key moments. And that is their issue with Snoop is, like, <laughs> I'm you talking first season no Shotzi, beginning of the said? game. Yes, I'm talking yes. first. I'm, I'm, I'm saying the beginning of the I game when you watched Ant. I'm saying the beginning of the game when you watched Ant. Obviously, end of the season, he was MVP. What I'm saying is like beginning of the game, Shotzi was obviously mechanically gifted, but it took him some time to get there. And he was put on a way better team, is what I'm saying. All I'm, sa all I'm trying to say is like, we're all saying Snoopy has it mechanically, but he's making mistakes. And that's yeah. what Boston sees. They're trying to facilitate him to be a more sound player is all I'm saying. I just, I don't, I, I mean, this is it, bro. Good like, God, I, 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 I just, I, I, mean, just, I just don't the, know if this is going to happen. At the end of the day, bro, at the end of the day, his roster that they did create, of all friendships aside, all right, forget about Ace and Friendship Cheese, forget about Slasher, forget about the changes that they made. Let's just look at the roster. Beans, P-Dog, Penta, and Snoopy. Lordy, welcome I back. Thank you. this roster is going to mesh together, bro. I don't know if this no, roster I, is going to get on the same page. No, I I'm no, I mean, I don't think this I roster is going from like to, going I to top see six. P losing fucking composure here. I see P Dog losing full. I think he's going to lose full. Well, I mean, it's just going to be it's going to be a lot of slaying. Uh, Beans is going to have to slay. I mean, dude, I, I just I don't know anything about Pentagram. I I don't I don't know if he's a, a role player SMG. If he's like a a slayer, I don't fucking know. I got a poke from the I mean, pod burner he needs, in TeamSpeak. Well, listen. Uh, of course, bro. I, I, it's I, an actual leak, though. I hope for I this think. team's sake, I hope... Uh, what's his name? I hope Pentagram is like a roaming slayer, and he's just getting kills, whereas Priesta can play a role, and then Beans will be a slaying AR. Because the team needs kills and respawn, and then search. I mean, you just gotta hope they he click and search because that was their, that was their yeah. biggest issue. And it was search. I don't by any. I don't think these players are bad. I think Pentagrams deserved a shot for a long for a time. Minute. I think. Yeah, hundred percent. I think Beans is a good player. I don't want to sit here and say individually these players are bad. I just don't understand the changes. I don't. I don't understand them. Like based on what I the COD that I've watched, I just don't understand the changes. And I, I don't know if this is the right group of players. I don't know if this is the right mix of players. I, I really do think meshing the right group of people. With the right personalities and the right mindset, I, I just don't know if these guys are going to see eye to eye. Like, I really don't. But maybe it'll work, bro. You know, maybe it'll well, work. Well, Tom, he, here's the issue with Boston know, is they are, no they are dead last in the league right now. 25 we'll points out of eight. We'll see. When Carolina is in the eighth spot. So, you know, Carolina I'm online iffy, but they've been decent on land this year. I, I don't Flex, know. Welcome I mean, back for 28, make bro. A change. You don't really get a window between major three and major four. Um, but I just don't see how this makes their control better. This might make their search better. Maybe that's the thought process. They're just doing what Carolina is doing, like Carolina LG does. They look I mean, like, they need a better we'll search. We'll find a couple team. of respawn maps. So we'll win our picks, and then we'll just grind out, get five search, and I got more get top intel. six. Or I don't champs. know if it's true or not. What is I got it? more intel. What's your intel? I got a poke from the COD burner in TeamSpeak. It said, I'll leak it this time only. This one only. Um, And he also said, you didn't hear it from me. <laughs> okay. Uh, Hixie to Vegas and Dylan Rex to Seattle. Hixie no, to Vegas I, and I, I, Dylan Rex to that. Seattle? Nah, I think we're just making shit up, bro. I think he's probably making shit. It's probably I think MC. We're just, just, I think we're just, I think we're just oh, making so I guess, shit up. I mean, I guess it could be MC just fucking literally just fucking capping, bro. You know what I'm saying? It could be just, him. I think we're just making shit up. You know, even though I wouldn't mind the Dylan Rex going to Seattle, I think Dylan Rex is a good player. I could I, think I, of some good landing spots for Asim, honestly. Yeah, me too. L.A.D.'s, yeah. Minnesota Rockers. No, I think, I think Ace him to Vegas would be got Tommy, like. Tommy, by the way, I got intel. Yeah, MC's, MC's currently in TeamSpeak, so that was not MC. Unless MC joined on another computer or on his phone or something. I do not know who this is. His name I is I don't think Connor. Vegas will change. I, just joined I mean, MC's literally right there. He didn't change his name? 
No. Well, I don't know who the fuck poked me then. I don't know who the fuck that some, is. Man. Some random person, bro. Yeah, I don't. I literally a random person, bro. I, I don't know who it was. I actually have no idea. But yeah, I, I think Ace of Ace of Vegas is a good shot, Tom. Well, I mean, I'm just not sure if Vegas is gonna change. Well, they and, like and everyone hates changed. on every, everyone hates on Purge, but like, I I do think Purge has gotten a lot better and he's getting better. Like, I feel like he has gotten better. He has gotten better, and he actually has good. But thumbs. he still struggled though. But he still struggled though, Tom. Yeah, I know. I mean, I think I think Asim for Purge could be a good move, but I I, I do like Purge right now. Mm -hmm. Um, um, yeah, I just think they got. In classic Vegas fashion, bro, they just they bro, lost. Bro, all in all, top four aren't getting fucked with, no matter what rosters are forming. I don't see any roster rumored 100%. roster that's forming that fucks with any of the top four. They're all playing for top six. They're all trying to get sixth. Like they're all playing the, for top six, bro. Um, the, the points you get for six are key. Not um, I mean, they're all playing for top six. I and mean, they, I actually think Vegas has a pretty good team, bro. I think Dylan attaching Geo mm -hmm. is an insane AR. Yeah, I mean, they're Vegas, good, Vegas but not like. But like the they have to, last year, bro. it's always going to be considered an upset. They're, they're, I don't think a yeah. single point in this year, the top four are going to fall out of the top four in power ranking. A hundred percent. And yeah. Boston, they're basically Boston from last the year. The top bro. four is fucking they're, too strong. I will say that. Vegas is like a decent team, but a zero game five ice this year. And, and every game five, they, play, they probably won. I'm trying to think if they've won a game five this year. Hold on. Why, is Teej, one, why right? is Teej telling me to shut up in his chat? His team is awful. What game five have they won this year? I'm just calling. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we haven't talked Rocker. about they Carolina. Rock in the game now, now five. That's it. in the chat. We got to talk about Carolina. Those motherfuckers need to make a change as well. Hell yeah, they do. Those guys need to make a change as well. T, I don't know what the fuck y'all doing, but gee, y'all got to make a change. Bro, if you're... If, Gwen, you're, you're safe. Gwen, you're safe as fuck. What the strays in? You, I think Gwen, Gwen, you're safe. Gwen, you Gwen couldn't be more safe, safe my boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but nah, there's definitely needs to be some some changes, bro. There's got to be some fucking changes here, guys. Um, yeah, I don't know if there's anything else left to talk about. We'll see what the fuck happens here. Doug sent some Martins in the chat. He said, "Am I?" Hey, Doug, what do you think about Boston's changes? Do you think it's a W or an L? I'm curious. I think, I think, I think Doug's no commenting on this shit. Doug, W or L on a, on the changes or no comment or no comment? What do you think, Doug? What do you think? I think Feel Doug free. said no comment. He bro. said, "Is this official? No, it is not official, Doug. This this is not an official team. No. What? Nah. For all we know, this could all be cap. This could all be fucking cap. This is all just leaks and rumors. You know, but it, not official. Please, please, but, fifth is and, good. and 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 for all we know, you guys know how things change, bro. We we've talked about about this a lot. This could be what's happening today, and then tomorrow they change their minds. And what could have been happening an hour ago, and now like, it's fucking you never three fucking times. know, bro. You never know. You yeah. know what I mean? Um." Read TJ's message. What did he say, bro? What the fuck? So did Tom, I have a, one of my mods is a pretty reliable Boston source. She's been correct before, and they, she, you know, this person, one of my mods asked the person. They said, just know, according to the Boston situation, it's all fucked. So obviously, it sounds like they're going through a lot of thinking. Obviously, this stuff getting out now is probably going to change our calculus. And who knows? It is the team that fucking Boston. I, I do think Boston has and placed top twelve four source. events in a row. Like the first, like they placed top twelve back to back. I do think they need a two person change. Like I, I don't think a one person change. One hundred percent. Like, agree. like they just need a new dynamic. They just need like life in there. Like I don't think one player brings a, like a certain energy to that camp. They just need like a fucking two new faces. They they need to get better. They need to get better S and D. They need to diversify and get a deeper like. Hard point map pool and again, welcome better. back for 16. Thank they've you. They've been just fucking so men at it. And the thing with all these teams that I think they're banking on Zen is that we might have two hard point new maps coming in, maybe a new control and a new S and D map. You know what I'm saying? But the problem for Boston is that invasion and sub base are probably what their two best hard point maps they play. So that I don't fucking know, blows man. with their old team. Now it's getting blown up. Wait, so what rosters do we think shouldn't change? Top four. I actually like LAG. I mean, they're, I mean, th those guys need to get into a no, facility LAG or something. Drop, LAG needs to drop either Adam or... Right now, this is the rumor. Minnesota oh, has they played well on land. Vivid, trialing, Dak, Gunless, and 04. They're winning Seattle research, is... though. Like, that's not... They're not going to keep doing that. And everybody keeps playing them... Maybe Slasher to LAG for Assault in? Everybody keeps playing them on their best maps. Like, please stop playing this team on high rise search and fucking sub-base hardpoint. Play them on another fucking map for the love of all things holy, man. I mean, Assault has been getting pooped on, but he did have his moments. Uh, oh, assault, uh, assault had a really good, at least one match on that, if I remember. Day. He had one day where he played well. That one well, day I mean, he played really well. But I mean, Slasher to LAG, that. maybe? If he's getting dropped? 
Or do they go with like uh, just, like what LG, ARs? What ARs are good in challengers right now? If Pierce LG's is rumored not, to be going to a different team, LG's already, he's not going to make a roster change. From what we know about this situation, they can only they're only allowed to call up their sub. Like they don't have the funds oh, okay. or the directive to be able to just pick someone up. All right. Well, there goes them. Vegas sticks. So I'm cool. With Vegas sticking. Thieves make a change. They bench Afro. Um, Carolina are interesting because I feel like Carolina can be top six, but I don't see that Carolina team. Carolina hundred percent should on a, change. For who? Or either Fellow or Clay. Wow! The same that LAG has. Bro, these teams banking on just pulling up to land and winning every search is just like... As long as T just safe, I, I, I don't, don't know, give a bro. fuck. It's a sketchy strategy. What? That's friendship cheese, bro. Me? What? Yeah. Hell yeah, I'll fucking... I don't give a fuck. Teach can drop point five. Team Teach. <laughs> don't give a single fuck. Uh, MC Snake, that went blind. What the fuck? But it suddenly, I suddenly went fucking <laughs> it blind. It suddenly went blind. No, but no, but no, but Teach is actually Something good. Something rescinded the red card. Now Teach is actually good. Like no friendship bullshit. Uh, T T no, they, they, they should Teej keep Teach. He's, like he's just better at respawn than he used to be. Problem, bro. You just it, like I don't think Fell and Clay are bad players, but you know, online activity, online games are so important in this league. The ten points, like you can't have both your ARs just getting uh, Teej, kind of difficult. Teach, I response. got you, my boy. I'm just saying, Teach. Everyone used to be on your ass. No way. Why is the breakdown so tweeting that, man? You see that, bro? Look, Tony, that's you're good, back. That's, a, that's good content, though. I'm not, oh, I'm you're not back. back, bro. Damn, that's good content, though. Tony, you're I'm fucking back. I'm not back, Tom, man. Go pull, up, go pull up the fucking... I'd still uh, be there if I tweet. wanted to be there. Go pull up the flank tweet. Flank tweet? I didn't see the flank tweet. Yeah. Listen, oh, I, know, I know Tej is going to be happy because Invasion Hardpoint's getting the fuck <laughs> out of there. We all know how they play on Invasion Hardpoint, so... They'll be happy to get a new map in the pool. Bro, I yeah, did who not else is there? Who else is there? I did not want this photo... Listen, can we talk about this photo? We were at the content shoot, and I got begged to take this photo, and I did not want to take it. So it looked like you were really happy to take it. Yeah, because I was trying to bluff it. I was sitting there losing full because I watched Chelsea Tottenham. If anyone knows about that Chelsea Tottenham match, they're I was saying, not happy with the results of that game. They're saying Zinn, Clay, Tej, and Gwyn. Dude, me and Clay would fist fight if that me and him won the same game. That team would be fucking game. terrible. That team would be fucking terrible. It would be awful, bro. and me and Clay would end up fist fighting. You know what I mean? That team would be fucking terrible. Holy shit. Yeah. Why are people saying TOS, bro? What are y'all talking about, bro? Uh, that's being weird. Okay, so who else? I'm about? trying to think. It's it's used to... I mean, Miami's going to probably make a change when once Real's situation sorted. Nah, Real, Real's got his visa. It is sorted. Well, I mean, once oh, yeah, can... but yeah, but what's Miami going to do? There's no way it's just putting in Real. And it's a one... like, <laughs> if, if, if Miami doesn't get rid of two or three, I'll be flabbergasted. No, They're 0-12 on, on land. They literally can't get a map win. I swear to God, one. I was forming this call to get one map win. Me, just, me, just Haggy, one. Zuma, and Ben Nassim are winning a search somewhere, 100%. dude. We're, we're, ben, we're winning fucking a terrible. Ben, I dude, Kirk yes, we, we'd sure. be awful, but we, dude, dude getting, getting, Ben would play at the bomb. We'd be in 3v4s, and we'd have to go crazy, but we'd win one. Nah, I get you, I get you a couple of kills on that. Like two. And that's an eight. I got you for two. Two? Yeah, I got you in for a two. Pro match? Wait, that's a yeah. dude. See, I agree, yeah. bro. I do yeah. think, I do think. I got some inspirational corns I'll play. I'll get some guarantees. Don't I worry. think Bant should be back in the league, bro. Like, I think Bant should go to Boston. They need, like, a, need like a smart-ass, ratty SMG who can just get kills. I think Bant's got, Bant's got fucked out of the league. So ben and... Isn't that just, like... It's just a like for, like, Asim and Ben swab, though. Wait, Bean said agreed. Motherfucker, Beans is trying to drop his own team already, bro. <laughs> he wants Bant's already. Look at him. Beans, why don't you make the play then, then? Okay, never mind. Hicksy in my chat said Ben is terrible. All right. No. He said that is terrible. That is. Great. I mean, there, that's there's, that's there's other person that got really fucked, bro. Dude, Timor, the Ian amount of players that there. aren't in the no, league that got the fucked league, out of the league is oh, crazy. Bad. Aiden's welcome no, back. Two one for twenty six. Wait, wait, that's actually crazy. Yo, Heretics kind of fucked everybody over. Mm -mm. They took Ow. four well, CDL what? spots from people like Hixi and Bants and shit, and are zero and twelve in land. I mean, just. Yeah. They can't buy a fucking map win, and Hixie's playing yeah, challengers, can't. dude. No, they actually fucking can't, bro. They actually can't. Which is kind of crazy because they started off the year hot. Dude, they looked no, good. I thought they, they just, were going to be like, they I thought they were going to be top six. They no, just they're... didn't progress at all. They didn't adapt. They didn't get Everybody's any kept playing the, people stopped playing them on terminal and. Yo, Scurvesies with a 10 bomb. Thank yeah. you, bro. My guy. Which is fucking crazy, bro. And, and now there's some Hixie said, Hixie said, it's the Spanish classic. Start every year good. That's what Hixie said. I mean, yeah, temp too, bro. There are a lot of players that are league caliber. I mean, listen, I've been preaching this forever. There just isn't enough spots that people get fucked over and they get forgotten about. 
That's why. Because everybody was on my. Hold on, hold on. Everyone was on my dick. I was tweeting oh, all these dumbass challengers. I was tweeting about Gunless, saying Gunless is not a challenge level player. Gunless should be in the league. All those morons were piping up. Well, Gunless can't win in challengers. Then he went to land and fucking won it. And I like. And he fried. He did fry yeah. too. I can't believe I had morons tell me that Gunless shouldn't have been in the league. I mean, yeah, shut people, up. People, people I, like I to was, write off like players, yeah. bro. Like Big P was a multi VP, multi champion. Like, and they don't even remember how he got removed from the league. He was sick. Yeah, the stomach. He issue. was super sick. Had stomach ulcers. Had to go to the hospital. He was so sick that they had to replace him. And by the time he got better, they're like, "Yeah, we're just gonna keep it." They just kept their team. They didn't. He just kind of got pushed out like and that. Got slammed and qualify for And then he got slammed. And then he got fucking slammed. And he never got back in. He never got back I, in after that. I think what COD needs is like, and and again, I'm lobbying hard to try and like get the league to pivot to this. Like what Halo does, bro. You want to have the, this harder teams and then open partner, bracket and then open bracket and that way, like. A group of these veterans can go through and just be hot and smoke all these mid pack. Oh, no, like, bro! If we had a sixteen six. team league, all the guys would be talking about for the most part would be in. Hicks yeah, would be, be in. Bance would be in. Temp would be in. Like there'd be the there'd be sixteen more spots. Like yeah, and you, there would be. well, maybe not partner spots, but they'd be in the mix playing pros, which is you know the important. Thing. And then you'd also eliminate the argument because I stand by the fact that challengers compared to the pros is two entirely different things, bro. Like it's just easier to get kills in challengers. And then those challenger teams would actually play against the pro teams and actually develop a sample size yeah. where they actually yeah, bro, be FC, like, okay, FC this guy fried FC against FC a good team. They'd be in. They'd be in if we had a sixteen team lead. The only problem is they'd still be ass. Nah, FC. <laughs> No, no. Okay, FC, Pat like, is going to say so dumb. Uh, uh, Pat, uh, Pat should be working extra fine, but uh, like for example, FC, well, we have a I, well. To be fair, we have a twelve-team league, and six of them are ass. So, uh, yeah. th th so it like, just it just like adding FC, more ass, bro. FC Blank Tom would be taking like kind of They be winning. Job. They be winning like scrims against pro teams, bomb pro teams. Like if they were playing against these teams, say a Boston a group stage. Like I think there's a good chance FC Blank's probably getting like top eight, top six of that event. Obviously, we'll never know. It's a huge what if, but like, yeah. I mean, I think. 12 team league is really no situation where it's like you know this year especially i mean we could just blame sam octane for retiring to be honest for the situation so. yeah, this leaking shit's kind of lit we might as well just start leaking everything now you know what i mean <laughs> we should just kind of change our ways now that i think about it we're just a leak squad now i mean let's think about it right whenever something gets leaked behind the scenes ben right and we hear it because let's be honest we we've heard every before the, this whole big wake shit this whole fucking seattle yeah. shit i knew all this shit before it got leaked right and then eventually gets tweeted out. I mean, if it's going to get tweeted out anyway, might as well just start leaking everything from now on. You know what I mean? 100%. Might as well just be the first to do it. You want to be the Fabrizio yeah. Romano of COD? Fancy yeah, exactly. with a 2 for 7 Welcome back. Uh, Thank you, bro. Motherfucker of COD. Yeah. What, what's going to be your, what's gonna be your like, you got your go shirt and you love it? Hell yeah, Ace. Like, hell yeah. It's done, dusted, like 100% confirmed thing. Nah, I won't ever tweet out 100% confirmed because. No, nah, but you need, day, like, you need like the, li the line, though. You know, Fabrizio's got here we go. Like, what's your gimmick? I don't know. For Fabrizio nah, Romano, see, he's got the plug, bro. He knows. He knows when it's confirmed. I would need to know 100% contract Yeah, but Fabrizio, signed, Fabrizio be capping, though. I mean, he spent all last year saying the Messi was going to stay at PSG, and, you know, that didn't fucking happen, so. You know what I'm saying? But. I don't know, man. Yeah, I don't know either, but I think that's all for, for Roster Mania. So where does now. I where does Asim go? Vegas, he Minnesota, might, Boston LA on Boston. Thieves. I think Boston about to get a huge Boston, backlash on or they, this. Or they, or they keep, or they could keep him on the bench for Boston and just bring him in if they if they want to. They could also do that. Yeah. And if that's the case, welcome back to FC Black. We're going for another chip, ladies and gentlemen. We're going for another fucking chip. Ace him on Seattle will be good. I don't it was know. Also the way, also the way that, listen, bro. Say but, uh, cheese. I don't give a fuck. Right. It was also the way that Asim got 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 whatever he got thrown to challengers, went to challengers, and literally. Well, no, no, no. The friendship league is challengers. horseshit. Everybody, he world everybody, he world star. Everybody who calls it a friendship league is an idiot because more and more every year, more challengers come in and more veteran pros that have been known forever get dropped down to challengers. Like, like there are more pros and challengers right now than ever before. So to call it a friendship league is is just faded horseshit, dude. It's it it couldn't be further from a friendship league at this point. Hmm. What do you there mean? are mm. some. There, my thing is that no, bro. Some orgs just suck cock. LAG not being able to drop drop a player means the org is shit. 
That's what that means. I think, we got a Jacob I, Pale tweet. We got a Jacob I think Pale there are, tweet. There are, there are definitely situations in the first couple of years of the CDL where people put in decision-making situations and picked up people they knew over unknown quantities, and they end up making shit fucking rosters because of it. Yeah, but so there was gotta, definitely but, but, friendship cheese going on. We got on a for Jacob a bit. Hale tweet, guys. It's Jacob not as Hale bad tweet. now, though, but at some point in this league, there definitely was way too much friendship he cheese. He said, Boston, from what I've heard, they've weighed up more options than I've had hot dinners. There is some truth behind all the rumors we've seen tonight, but I don't believe they've made any final decisions at this time. Clear changes needed throughout the team, though. I do agree that changes were needed. I'm not going to say that. And and I, I will agree that the, these are rumors. These are leaks and rumors, bro. I don't oh, know. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, uh, shit. Here he is. Here we go. Oh, uh, here we fucking go. Hey, son of a jinxed face. Do we want yes, intel? Do we want some intel? Uh, here we go. What do, do you, you have intel? Or, you have or intel? are you just coming uh, here? You're going to you, fucking you say some shit. Stream time. You might have to mute your stream, Tom. You actually have intel? Or you trolling me? Uh, no, you no, do not, dude. I'm not muting my. I'm chat. not typing in the chat. Bro, Hassan does not have CDL <laughs> intel, bro. He might. He goes in. That's like me saying I know who's playing at fucking live next weekend, dude. Behind the scenes, <laughs> it's nothing but cap. <laughs> I have no intel. Grim intel said I'm pretty sure the Asa move is set. The rest is no. up in the air. I don't think anything is set. I don't think anything's set. I have, I have off. I'm good at the off season intel, but I'm the mid, no chance of mid season. Yeah, because you get owner, you get owner fucking info. That's what's going on there. So the, so the most yeah. obvious one for them was Asim. That makes complete fucking sense. Okay, this is this is fucking crazy, bro. This is so fucking you guys uh, update Jay, wait, hold on, hold on. There's another Jake Hale replied to ghost. The ghost is help. Hold on, I'm gonna put this link in your chat. There's you another you can see this. Yeah, we'll pull this up. Pull this up. Ray says, the only name I've not really been told is at risk at this point. Though that doesn't necessarily mean he's safe either, just that I've not heard anything regarding him. Management loves Snoopy too and consider him a long-term investment, but not completely safe in my opinion. Clearly, there's a lot of moving pieces going on with Boston right now. That's what I, I was saying I, with Snoopy. It's like they're just hoping they can develop him into a longer-term like superstar. So they're just like sort of, I mean, they're, they're, they're playing the long game, really. That's why I don't think it. That's why I think it's less about Asim and more about wanting to keep Snoopy. I, I'm just gonna say, like, from past experience with CODs, like how long, for like traditionally concerning Snoop, right? Non-traditional English speaker, still learning on decision making, still learning on communication. Realistically, how long does it take for him to get to a level where he's like plus in those categories? Well, a year, well, a year and a half. Well, no, well, I mean, well, what you do you first? No, 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 no. Well, okay, hold on. So Snoopy starts with this team. The team doesn't work out. Yeah. Now they're going to shake up the dynamic, give Snoopy a new dynamic, new two teammates, new life. And, yeah. now, and now, now I think they're going to reassess where he's at. And then if it fails again, that's when they'll be like, okay, now that Snoopy hasn't worked in another situation, then we'll consider moving him. Like, I feel like they just want to like, see him involved in a different system before they just move on from him, before just saying, writing him off. But they're, but they're going to put themselves in a position where if this doesn't work, they're going to just need to... Do what they did fucking last year and roll the dice with no practice but ben, going into already, major four. Ben, it's already not working, bro. But what, I, what, what Tom and I are saying is like they're just gonna go through the motions and like he's still gonna make the same mistakes and they're gonna get back to the same conclusion six well, weeks from well, now, eight well, weeks from now. Or or he plays a lot he's better wasted, and the team is better. Two how, how can we know? I mean, yeah, well, it, it's easy to say it's, it doesn't work, but like, how do we actually know? Look at how many roster moves. For example, oh my God, Standy got dropped. What the fuck are they doing? Idiots. And now look at Vegas. Top six, probably the biggest team for upset potential. So the reality is nobody actually knows if the moves are good until the moves develop. 100%, but I, I'm i asking you guys a question considering you probably play with players that are in similar spots as Snoopy. They have a lot to learn about the game. Do you think he's going to catch up in three months and help them get they a chance? They think so. I mean, bro, I mean they, they watch him play every day. We yeah, don't. They, would, they, they, I, they, that, they've invested in five other sub players over three years and none of them have panned out ever. Right. I, I, will, I will say that it's not like the they've only, got the track record. I, I do agree with Tony on this one where it's like the only people who genuinely know what's going on are the people within the camp. The coaches, the GM, the team, themselves, the players. Right? So like they need to figure out whether or not that they can get this guy to where they want him to be. You know? And it, and, bro, I'm not going to lie. Dude. He was making a lot of mistakes, bro. He was making a lot of mistakes. Uh, Granted, you can adapt. You can get better. You cannot make those mistakes. I agree. If they believe in him, they believe in him, bro. I, well, and and apparently bro, they're making a coaching is. change, too. So my thing, they are. I don't know. I just I think, think... I think the coach brought Pentagram with him because they brought the coach up from Challengers. They took the, the coach from their Challengers team, moved him to the, to the main team. Pentagram needs to be a slayer is, is what that team's going to need. I mean, because Snoopy, I mean... 
comparably, like he's just like a finesser. We've seen him slay before, but like he's super aggressive. It's hard to be a consistent slayer while playing that aggressive. They need like an actual just like like a pred type player. They, they need a kill whore SMG, essentially. I, I, I hear you, but like, and I'll, I'll go on and say this like, I'll talk to people in this org and around this team like, Snoopy is making mistakes, like I said earlier, where there's a play call on SMD and he's forgetting the Bro, play call. Bro, we know he's making he's mistakes. He's young, he's 18, he's brand out. new. What I'm saying is they're going to reassess and continue to try and give him the benefit of the doubt. I think I like... Mean, I mean, they're going to reassess when they have one... They still the think he's an unknown variable. They, they, they gave him one team. They, they see him play every day. They're like, okay, we know this kid can be godlike. Can we tap into it with a new roster and a new coach? Just, and then, I, and then if not, then they'll drop him. But you can't blame them for taking a calculated risk. I, I understand. I understand where you're saying, Zim, but it's been it's been six and a half months. You've seen plenty of this guy play, and they are 25 points out of eight spot. Bro, like, once just, again, not a single player on that team has been consistently good. So you can't even be like you. You can't put it all on Snoopy. Because the entire team has taken turns I mean, getting shit on. Yeah, I don't, I don't think you could put it all on one oh, particular player. A oh, 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 100%, but I just think it's probably a situation where the guys got some talented gun skill, but decision-making is not ready to be a pro. Bro. So, okay, if they want to take the risk and try this out, you know what's going to happen probably likely in eight, eight fucking weeks is they're end up dropping him and moving them to a fucking challenger team. But ben, they have and you just waste it too much. T technically speaking, they really don't have anything to lose. Why I not mean, bet they, on the, why I mean, not yes and no. I mean, they can I get mean, worse. They can definitely. They, they, they yeah, definitely. Yeah, I'm not sure if they can get worse. It's a, it, bro. It's a disaster for ball. Bro, let's talk about that the journey of Boston over three years. True. They've it's a disaster if they don't qualify for Boston champs. Boston Breeze have gone last place at the last four majors. They really don't have anything to lose. Whether or not we think the fucking team is ass or not, they're making changes. So, bro, Boston get, has gone. It can't get any worse. Boston got in the league. This, this is the issue, guys. Boston was the last team to make a roster in Vanguard. They were decent in that game. They had some decent placings. They got to a loser's final. They got top three. They have gone backwards since Rebel then. with a tier they one, thank you. Single game. That is what I assume the issue with the management. Yeah, because they, they lost me and made, TJ Haley. They made zero fucking progress. They're stuck in the mud. And like, I get it, bro. If they want to give Snoop a chance, I'm pessimistic on it, but I see the thinking here. I'm not disagreeing with you guys. I understand the thing. And I'm trying to argue it from my perspective, but like, I assume management is just fed up that they have let this this sort of group of people they brought in to make decisions. No, make well, decisions. no, 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 no. Horse shit, horse shit, because they made, the, they formed a good roster in the offseason. Getting Slasher and Priesta were big pick pickups. Snoopy had a lot of potential. So five. before Adam, the season, yeah, I like, I like they were top team. six. Top so you can't Adam blame management six. because the team didn't show up because they formed a good roster. They get Priesta, who just won champs. You get Slasher from Atlanta phase. You cannot blame management. You can say they were slow, but you also... The, the, the issue with Call of Duty is you get such a small sample size. So the team placing top 12 once, you're like, okay, fuck. We still have a lot of capable players. We have to let them run it back. I don't think you can blame management at all because on, in hindsight, if, if we would all go back and be in their position, that's a team we would all form. You, you'd get Slasher. You'd get Priesta. You'd give liked, Snoopy the I, shot. We, we, liked, we liked their team when they formed 100%. Loyal, welcome but back I for 22. Ant with a 37. Thank you. Correct with a 0 for 60. Welcome back. Thank in you. This org, Outside the top three, they got in Vanguard. They've had virtually no success. Like they've been, they were mid last year. They're basically onliners last year. They qualified. For, I'm gonna be straight up with you. They qualified for champs last year, not because they were playing good events, is because they were fucking winning online matches. You can't count Q. last year, but I mean, like, I no, mean, but but that's the that's the issue though. You're accounted based Smith on results with a over the course of three back. years. Yeah, but Ben, you, you also act beginning. like it's so easy to form these no, good rosters. It's like not you act, easy, but someone's got to take. That's the no, issue. bro. That's someone's got to be accountable. And it's well, gonna be man. It's gonna be. It's the coaching management. That's. It sounds like they're making a player change, and the and the coach is going. They're trying to shuffle things up here. Because because the decision because the decision being made were poor. I mean, you're gonna say to me, look, uh, you really think that Boston? I know. I agree with you. I like the team they made in the offseason. It's very unfortunate the team didn't work out, and I don't know why they couldn't make that team work. Probably hear you. Okay. So but okay, unfortunately, you. every decision they have made. Since basically dropping you has been the wrong I left. decision. Watch your mouth. Okay. Well, since you retired, that's fair. Yeah. My bad. That's crazy. That's, I said, then if we give you a blank check, would you stay? I said, no, I'm going. Okay. Since, <laughs> si since, since then, like, I mean, they, they tried the Snoop thing before champs. Like they've, they've tried everything and I assume manager just fed up and yeah, they're, yeah, in a real, pretty, they're in a real position simple, where they won't bro. qualify for champs. They're in a real position. And I don't, I'm not even a former pro. I think it's pretty simple. They're betting on the 18 year old kid. They don't, and it's not working, and they have nothing to fucking lose. I think it's literally that simple. And 
that's that. Like, if you're yeah, bossing, right? Yeah, right? They have nothing to lose and they're taking a risk and they're just... I mean, honestly, just, I, 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 I kind of respect... Like listen, bro, I... Risks, well, I feel like well, they're just throwing darts at a dartboard. I disagree. They've been doing that since I disagree year, because, like, if Boston was trying to be this safe, like, okay, let's make the obvious move, let's just drop Snoopy, then, like, bro, who dropped Slasher? Like, and, and Asim, when, when they knew the community backlash would be large. Like, if they they knew dropping Asim, uh, they'd get backlash. They, they also they also knew that dropping Slasher, it's like, Objects, Slasher's good. Yeah. It's like, they don't give a fuck. They're just trying to do what they think well, they, they make sure the they team better. They drop it, my friend. They, they haven't yet made these moves, but clearly hey, they're thinking about Sam. it enough that it's going to now... So Damn, would like you have... confirm or what's going on here? Not, super nothing, late. Nothing, nothing, out nothing, is, confirmed. nothing is confirmed. confirmed. Nothing's confirmed. Okay. Yeah, I've been Damn, out all day. Do you no like it, Sam, going. or no? Do you like it? Well, I don't What's the What's the Boston, team? the Boston team. Uh, Pentagram, Snoopy, uh, Beans, and Preston. Preston. Um, I mean, I it's just a weird change. You could have argued for anyone to get dropped from this roster. Thank you. So it's like, I don't really think there's any like good or bad decision at this point. Anyone on that team could have got dropped with just cause, in my opinion. So Why did not doing? That, you're saying what? that um that they have nothing to lose and they're just so. Fucking... I mean, do you yeah. like the team they formed, uh, Sam? Do you like? I the like team Nate. They I think no? Nate finally getting his shots great. To be honest, what kind of player is Nate? Is he a kill whore? Because he needs to be. Uh, he needs yeah, to be like, like a, a corner like camping pretty... kill whore. Yeah, he's a pretty good, like, I hate using the word slay on our Cooter record, with a like, tier one for nine. Welcome back. Thank you. Why don't Boston do what Minnesota's doing in trolling people? Why make funeral decisions and trouble work? Do you think anybody should have been safe on Boston Sam? I mean, Nobody? to be fair, they could be trialing uh, people. How I mean, would we I know? I it's hard because you could, you could, like, argue on anyone's behalf to get dropped from this team. Like, Austin's been kind of mid since the beginning <laughs> of the year. Preston hasn't really lived up to, like, that kill whore role that he was slotted on this team to be. Snoopy's The Snoopy experiment has been. Pretty much a failure up to this point, and Asim really didn't change this team enough to warrant his roster change to begin with. No, like he played well at the event, but that was like pretty much like yeah, no, it's your. It. I was just asking you. I, was just, I we already gave all. Our, we yeah. already fucking went there. I, you're new here. You just got here. Yeah, so I want people to get your opinion. I, in right here. I will say this: the reason that I'm, I thought that maybe what they would do after this weekend is I thought they would take a look at their team and be like, let's go and make our team more disciplined. We might. That's reduce our ceiling Boston, or the problem with Boston. yeah always. i thought i thought their reaction to this this event would be like we're gonna try and make our team more structured and it might reduce our ceiling but it's gonna raise our floor and that way we know we can make champs and like if we can get a good run people get upset we'll see but i, I think they've done the opposite of that now i just don't know what route they take from a management perspective because i think literally from the inception of this org they've had an issue with just the fundamentals of Call of Duty. Like last year, they were the, by far and away the biggest kill war team I think I've ever seen in my entire life. Um, and then this year, they brought in Austin and Preston, who literally are are fundamentals in the dictionary when it comes to yo Call of yo ho that still ass just like could not put it together at all. Like you still have, which is the reason I was like been hard on Snoopy is like you watch the mini map and the way that these guys want to play, and it's just like you have a That's coin flip player mixed yeah. with Austin and Preston, which is just the antithesis of how they want to play COD. So well, like, no, what yeah, Snoopy so is they need kill wars. Like that's the year. reality. Like they need like 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 they need they, kills. They but, I mean also sir, it's a lot easier for the to work now. around in more uh, in yeah. excess of kills than I lack of. I feel like kills come with playing the game the right way. They do. But it is so much no, easier to get kills when you when you're when you're all on the same page, your trades are on point, your communications on point, your rota your rotations, yeah, your you're setups, your breaks, people. your every <laughs> yes, it's just everything's easier when it when, when you're actually playing as a team, when you're a good team, everything is easier, bro. Yeah. Everything. That doesn't matter how good you are, bro. I've been on I've been with on good teams with the best players in the world, and I've been on fucking shit teams, bro. And I, I know how it is on both teams, bro. And it is really, really hard. To be on a shit team that doesn't work together and perform, it's hard. Everybody, it's that's yeah. why I've always talked about culture. I've always talked about team culture, making sure everybody's got a good, me good personalities. Everybody meshes well with each other. Everybody's on the same page. Everybody looks at COD the same way. They, you know, some people look at COD in different ways, bro. Like they want to play it in different ways and, and, and do yeah. certain things. They need to be on the same page, bro. And, and that's the only reason why with this Boston roster. Now, granted, I will say again, bro, it can't get much worse. <laughs> I wouldn't have made these changes. I wouldn't have made these changes in particular. But they did get last place four majors in a row. They needed to make a change, period. They needed to make a change. I just yeah. didn't like the changes they made. And I don't and I don't know if this team that they did make 
it, I don't know if this team is gonna mesh. I don't know if I see like that teamwork oriented team here. Like, and, and it's a bro, weird group of players. I will. It's say. a weird group of players, and it's like maybe yeah, it'll prove me wrong. They might prove me wrong, and if they prove me wrong, I'll, I'll admit I was wrong and and yeah. say you yeah, that I was wrong. And they came out and they took care of business. But I just don't see it. I just don't see it. It's just not the direction I would have gone personally. I mean, could they have there. made like could they have made any change for us to really raise our eyebrows up? That's um, that's my entire point. Is they, know, they could have bro. dropped anybody, and I would have been like, okay, that's fine. I think, I think the only person that I would have been mind blown they would have dropped would be Preston because I think of all of the four, Preston's the one that like well, especially at the event. Tried the I think this year yeah, sure. yeah. I think Preston at the event looked the best. But like Austin, I understand because he's got some weak game. Like has been up and down. I like, like P Dog too. Like P, P Dog's just a good teammate, bro. Yeah. P Dog's good because you can get that team culture with P Dog. It is so easy because he's a good teammate. He can run any gun. He's got good comms and he makes I feel good like plays. Preston just fell into that shit. Like fucking, I don't know. I don't know the word I'm looking for here in Cobb. It's just like that that cliche of he's the fucking he's the role guy. He's the fill the gap guy. He's the fucking he's the. Well, yeah, because he was playing that. with the best slayers in the world for two years. I know, but like he just fell into he that. Got, he got he got set up bad and by. Minnesota, I think though. it's like it's impacted his like genuinely. I think it's not even like a a, a narrative that the community is running with. I actually think it's changed his gameplay so much to the point where he's had to like unlearn that. Well, Pre well Preston's always had same issue he's had for a long time which is like he he holds an angle and then he like gives it up and like he's got great movement good centering but like you know that he gives himself bad timings that's been his issue for a long time but i think Preston got fucked by the shit minnesota situation what a breakdown and, ben thanks dude and then fucking and <laughs> i appreciate it i appreciate it chris thank you and then, and then chris, the new york you just me to go fuck myself or was that mc that was mc okay thank you <laughs> hi chris <laughs> hello hi chris you? bye chris no oh, bye chris uh the goats now, Chris is still here if he wants to say something. No, I was just, uh, you really broke down Priest's gameplay. I really appreciated it. No, thank you. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Who else can we talk about? Because we can, cause we can beat the dead horse all day. All in yeah, all, Boston yeah. was absolutely dog shit. They could have dropped anybody, and right. I would have been like, okay, fine, whatever, do it, whatever. Did you guys talk about the other teams or no? Well, well you apparently LAG is not changing because they don't have the ability to because they just yeah. won't. Yeah, Carolina are an interesting one. Apparently, Vegas is not changing. Thieves already made their change. Um, heretics need to implode. What's going on with the Seattle situation? Uh, I think they're dependent on the Rocker situation because it seems like they're after the same players. Oh, uh, they're trialing the same people. Uh, yeah, 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 they're both trialing like think, four, right? You guys don't think Thieves will make another change? Oh, yeah, Vivid on AR, um, if that's true, I, I think that sounds think fucking will, okay. faded. I, I think Thieves... Honestly, I think Thieves actually were kind of like very close to the stage. I mean, that, that loss to LAG was real tough, but like... Honestly, if you take a look at how these played this split, I actually think it was not that bad. I don't think this change moves the needle much. They, they just get a couple more kills. For who? Map. I think they play better in control. The, if, the Joe for Afro thing? I think Afro was their best search player, and I think Joe I was, think like, Afro way better was pretty respawn. damn shit. I think you know. I think he was shit. It as was well, good but, like, in SD. I he was really good at same. search, which was like an important game. Yeah. I for think them, Joe's good. They kind of took off that. And I think Afro I think could be good, but I, and replace it for I, respawn, like, so. I like picking Joe back up. I actually like it. I just didn't I think Joe and Afro worked together. I guess we'll see. Kremp's been turning up in the kill department. Yeah, Kremp's been playing really well. Joe's kind of like a ratty SMG. I mean, their worst, um, their, their worst map is also going to get removed, which is probably very helpful. Well, Karachi is probably their worst. But sub is getting removed is going to help them if that actually does get removed. I like Joe too, but Joe, Joe's another one, bro, where he needs to make sure he's making just the right play. You know, He's got to change up his gears. He's got to know when to slow down. Like, like Joe's definitely... There was definitely problems with Joe with the Joe Afro dynamic when when they were playing together when that first LA Thieves there was a reason they made that initial because change. They, they, they couldn't they, they couldn't buy fucking kills as a team, bro. We'd watch them play and be like, "Gosh, we actually have right. great setups and they can't get one." Right, and we've talked and we've talked about that, bro. It's what but we just said five I, minutes I didn't, ago. Got to be a I didn't good think team Thieves to get kills. played that bad. I mean, Thieves like they battled hard against the top teams. They took care of business against like. Miami they, and Walker they over, and Vegas and IG. The state. one thing about Thieves, I will say, Amazing like, hard schedule. like is easy split, honestly, this Like, Thieves better hope that the Joe move does work because otherwise they're missing out on, like, the next up SMGs, like 04, DAC, that are, just, like, getting, like, that are supposed to be getting picked yeah. up. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's where, so, the, that's where Thieves are, are throwing in a risk where it's like they could have kept Joe on the bench and still had him there, then picked up one of these guys as, like, a safety net kind of. Started them for a They're bit and then waited. Bio. What did he say? Uh, this is Thieves. This is, team. 
Well, he changes. He, his bio says that he's a ball. He's on Boston Breach, but it might have always said that. That's the thing. He used to be able to use like Spoonbill IO to see people's like bio history, but What's shout his Elon. Twitter? Shouts Elon Musk. It's a uh, pentagram with the X instead of A at the end. Yeah, I don't think it's changed. It, it, it's been that. He's a player for the like, challengers. Team. Used to be able to see bio histories on like Spoonbill, but Elon killed that. So I'm GG. Guys, he's always um, been on fucking Boston. But I mean, for Thieves, Thieves' split is actually like, listen to this. They play Vegas, Miami, Carolina, schedule, right? Rocker, Boston, Seattle, Optic. They don't play they the top four team until last night. Yeah. Than, uh, like it, used to say, it used to say that he was a substitute for Boston Breach. Now it just says professional cop player. Well, just, so does Breach. someone have pro photographic proof of that? I don't, I don't think know. so. I think that's cap. Yeah, that and cap? you could easily doctor that shit. Bro, every, saying, like, every substitute or challengers lying? player, it says lying? pro. Because everyone's a pro. If you played pro once, they have pro in their bio. No, but I'm saying, Which why would the chat just lie about? Why would they just lie about that, bro? They're trying to stir that. the pot, bro. So weird, bro. I mean, shit. If I'm single, and I'm a pro. I'm not gonna put substitute. I'm a, I'm a pro. Oh yeah, absolutely. Uh, the bitch, I don't want to say bitch. You know, the <laughs> girl, oh, you said if you're. Oh, you said if you're single. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, just say, you know, about, God, someone's bro, saying in my chat that's been like this. Uh, since I Modern think he's too. married, so. Okay, well, I'm just saying in general. In general, nah, I mean, just in things. general, yeah. If you're a substitute, okay, yeah, like you're uh, let, let, nah, but that, but that is true though, bro. If you, even if you are a substitute on a pro team, you're a professional player. Bro. Correct. You're you are a professional player. You're you're loyal signed, with you're a gift to a Ryan. Thank you to a professional organization. You're a professional player. Period, bro. You know what I mean, yeah, you know, huh? It'd be like that. I want to know what Carolina do. I think they're not do anything. You think Carolina is just not going to change at all? I don't think they're they're all, they're 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 all Carolina's not going to change anything. Oh, I mean, together, well, I mean, that could help them actually. You think I mean, so? I mean, hope. I mean, I don't know bro, for sure, they, but it could help. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong, bro. Love Clay, love Fellow. They need kills. Yeah, and they, they, they don't two get any. The bottom. Who would you keep out of the two? Uh, probably Clay. Fellow, it's it's I mean, a real tough it, decision. I mean, you can make an argument for either one of them. Fellows play better than Clay on land, but I think Clay is just nah, but better that, to have no, in that spot. No, than that Fellow. no, that team does need someone like Pierce. I actually think Pierce you, they slot in great on that MCW. team. Carolina is a very difficult remaining schedule. That they're, not gonna get, they're not going to get rid very of Clay. hard. No, Carolina plays. No, I don't three think they should get rid of Clay. Carolina plays three really tough for us. Fellow, fellow struggled the most with Carolina. I think uh, he yeah. he did perform better. He played good at search, didn't he? He, I mean, oh, yeah, yeah. Which, which helped to get top six because they didn't. He had a good event. He did have a good event. Other than the last series. I don't think lost... on, online matters though now, bro. You know, like, yeah, online. Well, their online important. schedule is brutal, Tom. They play, they play three of the top four in the in both the remaining. Sports, Carolina so does. Like, yeah. Damn. So they're they're in like four and three best case territory. Yeah, actually, yeah. Clay and Gunless would sports. kill each other. Yeah, they would fucking kill each other for sure, bro. Yeah, no, I, mean, I don't know about that duo. I don't know. I mean, I personally think that they can that they should make a change. And remember what they did stage one, like if they go like oh and four, oh and five, like they're definitely good for probably making I would one, just like, be shocked four. if like uh, let's say Slasher and Asim get dropped. I'd just be shocked if Slasher and Asim are in the pro league. Like that'd just like blow my mind. I don't think Austin's gonna be in challengers. I think Austin will get picked up somewhere. There's no way that they don't, someone doesn't play with Austin. Who's going to pick him up, though, Sam? I have no LHG? idea, but bro, there's no way Slasher is not in the CDO. That's what I think. I don't know, bro. Well, they, there was, they, there was they, a time where Austin was in the CDO. Up. But what about they, Seattle? Who's going to pick him up? Because it's not going to be Carolina. It's not going to be... Could be Seattle. Why not what? Seattle? Could be Seattle. Wait, who's Maybe Seattle replacing uh, Alec with? The rumor's like, it's like 04, right? I think right now. LAT there's, there's Slasher been... might be insane for Nasty? No. I don't, I don't well, agree with that. Well, hold on, because then you could still... Dan doesn't need to be the slowest player on the team. They could have Austin do it. Yeah, but... No, but I don't, I don't, know, if, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't think the AR duo for Thieves, thieves is an issue at all. I don't run it back. Well, dude, they've had a... Think about that team, bro. Like, like Austin had known Cap for a very long time. Shane for a very long time. Like, I, I don't know. They've already had one go with Austin on Slasher, Thieves. Slasher, Hook, Abuza, 04? Yeah, they I already had one, one go with them. That reminds didn't go me of well. Austin's fucking... Um... NB team in World War Two. Yeah, they, they probably have one go at it. It didn't go well. Oh yeah, that that fucking team totally missed the mark. Bro, what happened to Awakening, man? I want to talk about Joe. I don't I understand it. It doesn't know, make any sense to no, me. It actually doesn't make any sense. He's gotten space shame, bro. I, I, you, you want my you want my conspiracy theory? I actually want it. Yes, because because uh, I will say theory. this one right. makes did, no did, sense. Did, did, this is my conspiracy theory. I, 
I think he's got hand issues and he just doesn't want to talk about it because he's just like, he knows if he talks about it and he does actually have like hand issue type shit, he's, he was just going to get dropped. I think it's a, Which, think that's, that's a that is an insane shit. conspiracy theory, dude. Well, I, I mean, think it's because the tape, right? It. He messaged me a, a, a year or two ago saying that he was having problems and he was oh, like, I didn't know that. He was oh, trying I didn't to get advice. Oh, I didn't know that. Honestly, and, and he, well, I mean, a lot of players have messaged me that saying they have, more than yeah. half the league has, has messaged me but saying you're talking they have about the like KT tape. You're talking about the KT tape. He's got the KT and shit. tape is what gave it away. The KT I, tape on stream, bro. When I seen the KT tape, I, yo, why is the, the, the KT tape? Like, what is that? Like, Blaze God, welcome KT back for 12, my boy. Hell yeah. Through, like, One year. My ACL shit when I was like, tore my ACL and shit when I played ball. And I used to use that shit all the time when I was dealing with injuries. I feel like the only time people use KC, that KT tape is when you're playing through an injury. You know what I'm saying? When you're playing through an injury. Guys, guys, that's not federal, bro. His hands were sore. It's not like a big thing. It's, 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 people have sore hands. Everybody's got sore. I, I didn't Am I playing anymore? I might hop thing. back he, in. Awaken Shadow, for welcome back for a full year. Guys, Thank this you. This was years ago. You know what I mean? This was, it's not like he... It's not like he texted me that last week and I just completely blabbered to you guys. It was years ago. He's been playing for years. It's been he's been in the league for for years. Everybody's dealing with that. Shit. I'm just saying the KT tape gave it away for me, bro. In my opinion, I think the KT tape was like I think, was like, I, oh, think I think faded for this tape, but it's all good. You think so? Well, well, yeah. I, well I mean, I mean, last year he was still a great slayer. Like whenever he maybe messaged you, but it, I, I just don't get. I don't I mean, know why it, he can't I mean, get kills. And it, shit. It's it makes bro, no sense. It, it, bro. I played next to that guy. That guy is godlike. Like that's what I'm so confused about. Yeah, he's a really good player. That's like why that I think guy, something wrong. that guy is crazy good. Wrong. People are saying EQ, bro. Big Wake has a no, snap. No, no, it's not, bro. bro. Big Wake is has a hey, fucking snap. He hey, who, straight, guys, bro. who are you guys? Who you guys just talking about? Awakening. Wake. Uh, Big Wake Awakening. Oh, uh, okay. And he's a good player, bro. He can shoot fucking straight, bro. He has always been a fucking talented player. Well, some, some people just Tommy, you want to talk about Garrett Heist? Bro, I, well, I was we, just were just talk, we were just bro, talking about that. We were just talking about that. Talk about Tommy Malone. Today, I, I know I brought that up in your stream, was it yesterday? Yeah. yeah. Bro, Heist was insane, bro. Heist that was, was good. An anomaly. Heist was good. What happened to Heist? Just, he bro, started, I, met, I met that fool in a, in a free for all yeah. lobby at 3 a.m. And we, like, back in Modern Warfare 2, and we were playing for like four hours straight. And I, when I realized, Captain like, Never Die, welcome he back, was my so boy, cracked. legend. And then I brought him in the next, like, and then I 1v1 him at like 7 a.m. and he smacked me around like 20 to 9, bro. <laughs> and that was back when I was like, bro, that was back when like nobody could beat me in free for all, like, with sniping. And the next day I recruit him to phase. And then, like, long, like, long story short, I, I bring him into the pro team back when it was like Methods was in phase, Embos. Uh, who was the other guy? Crow Crowder, Chris. It was Crowder, right? Yeah, yeah, facts. And then uh, Heist plays, uh, Heist hops on, and bro, and Heist is fucking quick scoping these pros in the fucking, you know what I mean? Uh, like, Heist was good. The only problem with Heist is we go to the event and you have the Tito's bottle vertical. <laughs> That's the only <laughs> oh, issue. The... He, he had the Tito's bottle vertical. Oh, he's a drink or dumb? He was. He's fucking yeah, nuts. Nah, I, oh yeah, he was passed he was out on a balcony. Mind. Ambulance picked him up. Oh fuck, he was hella fucked up. Derek, I, did, I, did I, I was on a phone with Derek. Realized his dad telling him his son wait, has to come to the event. Wait, can I say something? Is that really a crazy take to think that there's something wrong? The, why Big Wake's not performing? That's just like outside. Like I feel like there's got to be something like. Bro, you don't go from being like a top of the line slayer like that to just an, what an absolute snap to just like really struggling to get kills. I don't. I, I feel like there's got to be. I mean, it's not like a bad wrong. take if there's actual substance to it. I mean, if 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 there was no context clues and you just pulled that out of your ass, that's kind of crazy. I'm, but you said you saw the tape and he messaged you a year ago. He messaged me a couple years ago, bro. That's like the, it's a couple years ago. I was just saying it's the KT tape, bro. That's what gave it away. What does KT me, tape even do? I don't know. I tried it back in the day, and I don't think it did fucking anything. I'm gonna wait, be honest that, with you. Wait, wait, KT tape is that black, that black tape you put on when people have your shoulder fucked up, right? I yeah, guess. it's like it ha it does something with like muscles or blood flow bro, or that's some just shit. placebo, bro. I swear, yeah, bro. I think it was a placebo know. when I wore it, but I mean, it might help certain people, bro. I don't know, like it might help. You, you see, you see, like you used to see, like oh wait, NFL somebody players, I just got uh, major league baseball players do it. Like, hey, the Tom, fucking... I am a licensed physical therapist, and let me tell you, when I say KT tape is an actual joke, you can use Scotch tape, and it will give you the same effect. So don't let these companies lead you astray. But All I right. thought the same when I saw Wake's hand. So see, a giant he scam. He said, "I thought the same same when I saw Wake's hand, bro. Bro, when I was ha when I was going through injuries, bro, and I would, bro, people would, people would recommend KT tape. I shit. will say, bro, like, okay, let's you know say, saying? let's say there's a world where he had an injury, like, 
it, he should have handled it and then came back. But the problem is now his stock has been like has plummeted to where it shouldn't be. Like let's say hypothetically, like he had a hand issue, he tried playing through it. Like use Ender as an example. Like Ender takes a break, he comes back healthy, and he's fucking frying. The same thing would have happened with Joe hypothetically if there was an issue. If he went and handled it and came back. Mm -hmm. But now that he like now a stock somehow in the dirt, and we have no idea if this is true. I mean, we literally just pulled that out of our ass. Somehow. But we watched this guy play COD for like four months. What happened to him? I said it's not so. He then said somehow in the dirt. We we watched him play COD for four months, and then somehow we know why. Bro, I don't understand, bro. No, nah, awakening. It's, it's, uh, the awakening shit blows my mind. Bro, that guy's he, godlike. The, the weirdest thing is, bro. He was he such a. Good. Uh, he was a great. Uh, he's been a great S and D player almost every year he's been in the league, and this year he's been. Just, that's been his worst game mode by far. He's been one of the worst search players in the league. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't know, I don't. I mean, people slump, man. It could just be a slump. It could be like a mental thing, and he's got to kind of piece it back together now that he's probably off the roster. But it's definitely odd for sure. Yo, so what's the deal with us, Sim, bro? Why, like, is is that is it confirmed or is it just so a rumor? Uh, rumor so, that he got so one rumor of my, right now. So one of my mods, Junie, who definitely has a good Boston source. Like when she's Boston info, it's usually spot on. She just, she just sent me a message that, like, her source said, it's just sad seeing the wrong people get the blame when they have zero or little to say in decisions. So it just sounds like, it sounds like Boston's kind of panicking and they're trying to just massively change things up. And this is sort of what they've decided to do, at least right now. Basically, Tom, it's all rumors right now, but it's not looking good for Asim, which Yeah. But, like, but like why I see him and not, like, you know what I mean? Why I see him? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, that's a great question. Know. I, I, every time I speak on a situation, it's friendship bias, but I, I no, really do think... No, it's not friendship it's, bias. It's just, it's just that no one should have been safe. So it's just I, like... I, I agree, but I, I think... They're getting Dominic rid of... Is insane. They're getting rid of the... I mean... He went to Challengers, dominated, won the event, went crazy, said the same came, about to, all of them. Came, came to the team, played well, and, and they were still... He was doing whatever he could. He was still playing bad. I mean, why... Why would you bring the new guy? Why would you get rid of the new guy? He just got there. I mean, they still consider Snoopy a new guy. Listen, new all guy. I'm saying is I think we're, we're beating the dead horse, but I I think it was less about Asim and more about just betting on Snoopy. I, don't, what, I, 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 I think Zin is right. How, how heavy they're going in on that Snoop experiment. I mean, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, they must in. really like. They, they must all really all see shit where they're like dropping one twos like Paco was in the human league. I'd be like, okay, I can't understand it. He's playing good, but he's not like takeover mode, winning the map solo no. type deal. Yeah, but they but they think so. They think he has that potential. They're doing anything for him. I mean, the, I I listen. All I'm saying is like they have gone through so many SMG players in the last like two and a half years. Just think about how many sub players they've gone through in that. Yeah, roster. but Snoopy Snoopy got their last tournament of last year. No, he, he's still yeah, blue. but they've had him on the roster now for like eight ten months. Like you've already. I listen. People can develop and get better over time. Like I hear you on that, but. They've got plenty of data, and they've seen him play plenty enough. Yeah, I mean, some of your chats today, they think Snoopy's Hydra or Shossi. They're just betting on that. I, I don't they, know. And, and to them, they have nothing to lose. Like, they're just like, fuck anything to make hey, it work. May, may, maybe they see something that we don't. That's that's what I'm saying. They just see him I mean, scrim every I, day, and they're like, I okay, this guy obviously has it. I, mean, I don't know. Are you guys still talking about Boston? May, maybe he just has yeah. a big dick. Oh yeah, it could be, it could bro, be Pogo sticking fuck, around Tommy? the facility. They like bro, looking at it. What the fuck, Tommy, bro? Let's go, comms. Uh, dude, are you kidding me? Yeah, I mean, this this is listen. We're in the roster mania period right now. Especially if Minnesota's gonna be trolling people, like they're just gonna hold this whole thing up. Like Seattle's not gonna make a decision if they're looking at the same players. If Boston starts looking at the same players as Minnesota, are it's they even scrimming yet? Or I don't think teams are even scrimming. I heard yet. Teams aren't teams scrimming, scrimming until like Saturday. Off. Wait, like the earliest oh, people wait, are probably start wait, so oh, so they're not even starting trials until Saturday. Yeah, that's yeah, why. And they also have to test new maps while they're trying yeah. new players. God damn. Yo, yeah. Thick Bonies, welcome back for 13. Yeah, Thank Tom, you, they, Legend. Breezy with a tune for 15. Yeah, welcome back. Thank you, bro. He's muted out, but I'll poke him so he comes back. Oh. Does anyone play in ranked soon? Yo, what's up, Crowder? What up, bro? When you're when we're done talking about Boston, dude, are you playing? Yeah, rank? yeah, yeah. I'll play rank with you when, when we're okay. done. I'll play rank with you when we're done. I mean, Crowder, if you know, if you want to, uh, you know, if you want a fucking star, I mean, I, could I mean, I it. would love nothing more than a star on my team named Kason. Yeah, I have a question because the, it's a post on Reddit, and some people are flaming me. They're saying I'm biased in this situation okay. as well. I'm, okay. I am literally biased to every fucking situation. I don't know how. Okay, what is it? Best trio. Okay, three uh, teams, three trios, right? Simp, Sally, and Abizi, right? 
the Coal Trio, Crim6, Aix, and TP. And then the Optic Dynasty Trio, of uh, which would be... Who, who was the trio in this situation? Let me see who the trio was. Formal, Crim6, and Scump. Okay, rank those trios. Rigo from with a two for 23. Welcome last. back. Thank you. I had the Cold Dynasty last. And I had, you have first? I, had, I had debatable between phase or optic first. I said, that's a, right that's now, a cop out. Who would you pick I, first? I think it's optic first. Well, I think right now it's optic right based now. on the stats. It's optic. I, I, I will walk it back because yesterday I was like phase. But after looking at stats, the only stat that the phase guys have over them is the. There was one stat. But, but hold on. Here. The stats shit is so. Bro, there's so many less events no. now than there are. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, hold on. No, it's did, also the it, bro. It's the Jordan LeBron the argument. Though. It's the it, it, it's the yeah. Jordan LeBron it's argument. The, 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 the OGs say Le, uh, Jordan, and the new gen people, as people grow up, start saying the new guys. It it just it it's a going to be an ever long combo that will never have a definitive answer. Ever. I mean, it's LeBron because LeBron's doing stuff in year twenty. But I hear you on your argument, though. You're just surrounded by like you know. Bulls fucking apologists all the time. But I hear what you're saying. Like, just, you know, those COL and Oddly played an era where they played 12 events a year. And at best, we get five a year now. So, okay. Did, I also you, think LeBron you, for the record. Yeah. I mean, LeBron's doing stuff in year 20. No one's ever done the history of the NBA, but, you know, that's what it is. Go ahead, Tommy. Uh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm going back to go look at the fucking stats here. There was, nah, uh, was phases average shit. placing. Their, fa their average placing is fucking insane. They have a 2.6 average placing, which I thought was insane. I think that's crazy, especially for how long they've been playing together. Um, But everything else between like top three percentage, grand final percentage, event win percentage, you, the Optic Dynasty has that trio beat. The, I, the, uh, the other thing, Tom, is the phase trio has been together way longer than those other two teams. They've been together for yeah, I know. That's fucking, also, it's going to be that's, five that's, years. That's also true. That's also true. It's like double which the I distance think, of those teams. Which I think is another argument as yeah. to why you could put phase number one because of longevity. But people were cooking effectively, the effectively the and therefore we're going to... I think that's the argument for them to be second because they should have way more event wins with that longevity. Well, yeah, I'm leaking one. I'm Jordan, that's back to the Jordan leaking LeBron one because it is... You know, back when COL was playing Black This This change is absurd. Brian, the game like full time getting paid full time. And it's probably less getting paid full time. Like it's just different eras in which people now you got challengers teams like playing yo, full time. Yo, hold on. What's everybody else's teams. rank? Because I got I got phase optic or optic phase top two with Cole last, and I was getting cooked for that Cole last take. So do you guys I don't even want to answer, no, because it's impossible. It comes back really it's just a right? different era thing. It's like what? literally it's literally impossible. Yeah, but I don't but like there is Wait, no way to answer it. I think I think it'd be optic cooking. Yeah, well you shouldn't answer it. There's literally no way to answer it. I think wait, if you wait. had to, it gone to my head, optic phase COL. Hold on, guys. I have an actual question. What era was harder to win? This era or the CWL era? You guys would know this. It's this era. It's this era, not even close. It's this era. This well, era is way well, harder to win. Well, bro, it's always going to be the well, current well, era. It's, it's, it, well, correct. Yeah. It's always going to be, but it just, like Ben just said, Yeah. some people were like still working jobs and going to school in certain eras. Like now it's literally a full time livelihood where like, Everybody is like all in with coaching staffs and analysts and VOD is well, yeah, but performance that, coaches. The only thing like, I don't like I mean, about this era is, is how you don't you don't gotta win a lot of series. Everyone though, but you are playing. Oh, you were playing. You yeah, but Tom, that goes the other. That goes the other. The series. Yeah, that's that's a, I was just about to say that. It, it go, the it goes the, the thing is, is back in the day, you had to play a lot more series, but half of them were yeah, fucking ass. Yeah, you got absolutely, bro. The tournament didn't start for good teams until like Saturday night. Literally, you don't have like. I just remember back in the day, bro, when we won a tournament, it just felt like a grind, bro. It just yeah, felt just like it was. The, you played like eight, eight, nine playing. series. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but Tommy, I would, every I would play wake match, up every you, day you and play GGEA Orange yeah. at 10 a.m. Oh, yeah. I'm just saying for certain anomalies because when I see like a... With one eye closed. That's a good point. That's a good point. When I see like a bottom team, Chris, win two series in their top three and they had like a good, like an easy road and shit and they got blessed, it's like, all right, bro. Wait, what the... You know Also, that's a good point. Talent... Talent was but more divided back then, I feel like. team gets lucky every once in a while, but they don't get yeah. People yeah. made roster changes every... Uh, Wait, I've USA seen his roster changes WL? now. Busco, welcome uh, back for seven tanks. Well, 16. 16 right? plus, like, yeah, talent, millions and shit. Talent back then was also divided. We're like, People so many different teams had fucking stars. Event. Bro, you think roster made with six teams is bad now. Five teams. It used to be, like, yeah, used to be fucking 10, almost 10 the entire plus. league. Yeah, but was there actual just, balance dude. though? Or was there like absolute top three? Yeah, there were there were times where there were there were times where there were parody. Like there were parts of like Ghost where there was very heavy parody. Like IW had some good parody. Well, Ghost where we were playing Blitz. Well, <laughs> true. 
Oh, well, don't. That I got argue with Nate Chad about that on Nate the weekend. Nate saying the other he's day trying to argue the other day, bro. Game mode. He was trying to say he was good at it. Because he, yeah, he didn't have to shoot his gun. Yeah, yeah, right. Right. <laughs> any, any, ga any game mode that you win by sh not that shooting is the good. enemy is, is a dumb game People are not going to watch Shelly and be the fucking goalkeeper on Blitz. Let me tell you, this shit's not going to be fun to play like. Bro, we were playing Domination and Blitz. Well, I mean, goalkeeping Blitz was a bad play back in the day. That was a bad play. You were supposed to push out and, like, make sure nobody, like, hold the lanes and make sure nobody Bro, can get by. you had a role in Blitz where people didn't shoot their fucking gun. Yeah, they were sneaking. They were just yes. letting people run by them and trying to sneak past Talk lanes. Talk about fucking talent. Ben can do that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, that's crazy. My bad, Ben. It's crazy. Sorry, ben, it's true. Fucking... I mean, ben, ben could have played Blitz at a professional level and just let someone run by him. Yeah. Ben said he's getting two kills in S and E in a pro match. I'm calling. Cap. No, he's not. Ben is getting that. zero kills unless he's getting zero kills. Oh, I'm slamming Ben. I'm Ben. I'm by the way that one on one. I'm slamming you. I want. You, I want you. To ben know is that. getting oh, zero I kills. Can I watch this target. one on one? Wait, let's no, do it right no, no. now. No, not right let's now. Let's do it right now. No, no, not right now. Whoa, but hold whoa, whoa. on, Brown. Do you see me play? You know I'm yeah. fucking them up. Yeah, you're fucking them up. Okay, sound like Why not right now? Why not right now? Right about that. Bro, I haven't played in like five, six days, bro. Ah, uh, here we go. Ben's oh, fucking ass. You can't call him out like that and then not play. No, no, no. Ben knows I'm destroying him. He knows. Yeah, me and Kason have to. Like an hour warm up or have to 1v1 in. We have to do it on land. Guys, bro. I was slaying. On land. We have to do it on land, bro. Ben, you don't yeah. deserve land. land comment. Oh, shit. What? What? We have to do it on land, bro. You can't, you can't call Ping Chi Ben. I'm, I'm calling the land. Where are you going to play 1v1 on land? We do it in Toronto, bro. We get two sets. It's not that hard. Yo, you want to a a are you that terrified? That it, so do it online right now first. And get ben a, wants to land. Land. Yeah. Nah, Ben wants to blow this whole thing up, bro. He listen, wants to get a prize. Yeah, make w Tom, 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 I was slamming Ian. Are right, you? Th I'm going to have no problem Ian, slamming Ben. That nub? That nub. I was slamming yeah, that he, nub. But he don't have a thought. What? I was. No. No way we're disrespecting the nub bro, like that. No, 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 I'm talking about, I'm talking about Chris. I'm not Yo, talking about you. You were not slamming that nub, bro. Bro, I was. I was. I'll pull up the footage. I'll pull up the VOD. No, you weren't, bro. Yo, I'll pull up the VOD if you want me to pull, pull it up, bro. What were you playing him? Where were you playing him? Yo, yo, there, said, there he is. Yo, he's in there. He's in there. Hey, what you talking about? Right now. No, 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 said, no, no, no. Kason said he's been, he's, he, he said he's been, Ian said he's, he was looking like okay. Mike. Ian, you have to admit, Ian, you have to admit I was playing great, bro. And what? Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, here we go. Do, we, do, we drag, do we drag Ian the channel? You have to admit I was playing great, bro. You cannot, come on, get him in here, bro. Ian, I'm dragging you in. Ian, have my back, there. bro. Ian, have my back here, bro. Look, Kaysom was, uh, he's better than Ben. Okay. That's all you But I was hear. dropping, I was literally dropping wheel numbers. So, but, if ben but Ian, Kaysom I was going one, positive every game. And I had some, I had some good kills. I was no. winning with Gersh. Somebody no, move me back. No, no, Kaysom, no, no, you're solid. No. Is Gersh terrible? He can't average over 10. He may be worse than wow. Ben. No bullshit. No, whoa, yeah. that's disrespectful. But Ian, I was putting up 25 damn, 30 every game. Damn, I'm my fucking back, man. Hey Ben, are you the best? Guys do. We got beef. How do we have fucking beef over oh, what? Beef, over what? Because I didn't pick, for that I didn't, one, I didn't pick your team last weekend. <laughs> we have beef over ben, that. I don't watch. I don't watch any of the content you so make. What, I don't know what's if you pick my team. Oh. What's, 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 what's <laughs> the beef? Then? What beef do we have? Team, ben. What, be, what beef do we have then? Dude, you'll, we'll talk about it later, dude. Yo, Chris, but we never talk. So what are you gonna talk about? Then a phase coach watches the breakdown. What the fuck is this shit? I tell them to break the GAs. I said I don't give that cross. I love that. I love that. And then I go to the casino when they play. I don't even. I love that. You go to the casino when they play. You're barely yeah. clinging on to your Yo, job. Yo, Tommy ranked? Yeah. Hell yeah. Wait, Benny, why have the money on? Wait, 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 I'm about to get on a burner and play with Crowder. Ben, ben, oh, okay. Hey, we're we're one on one we can, but, uh, but it's got to be for money. We can put, we can put some gets on the line. Wait, what down. the hell? Holy Dude, shit, next week. Bro. Wait, Kason, yeah, I didn't, how, wait, how much? wait, Kason, I didn't forget I about that 2v2. Hold on. Kason said he paid me for like 5k. Me and me and Seth versus Kason and Zuma. What? When did this happen? When did this happen? What the fuck did that happen? Bro, you baked? Oh, what happened? Wait, what? Did you talk about this at live? Is this a live no, conversation? No, no, or, or maybe it was a thousand bucks, but it was it was it was a two v two. It was you and Zuma. I promise you, I did not play you. Oh, not five grand, me and Kason versus you and Scott. No, no, I promise you. No, Kason said he would. No, 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 no. Yeah, it happened live. It already happened. No, Kason challenged us, and he was like dead ass, and I was like, bro, what? I must have been high, bro. I don't know. Kason, are you fucking faded? Yo, listen, listen, listen. I don't recall that, Zen. And I'm gonna and if I said that oh, yeah, I don't recall Chase. I, I, Kason, I'm going to just so you know that. Kason, just so you yeah. know, it might have been me and Bose, I don't know. But if we killed if we killed Tommy, I'd stop mid game and go to twenty twenty cents just to kill you at the at, at the end oh, of the game. Oh, that's oh, not right. Shit. Zen, Zen, why don't I beat you twenty twenty cents? Oh shit. Are you out of your mind? Uh, how am I missing that? Twenty twenty cents? I'm winning. Let me see. Oh, is that shit hard God. to control? How much money, Kason? 
But that's just not that hard to control, Kazan. It's really not. Let me, let, Tom, test it out before I make this bet, bro. Let test me it test out. it out. Bro, Kazan, respectfully, do I not bet against me in a 1v1 on any 20, sense, 20, any no, setting. 2010 is world sorry, people ranked. It's, it's, it's tough. No, no, I see Chris Parasite run 2020 in ranked. I think Zen's not going to have a problem. Are you saying he sucks? No, I'm saying Zin's gonna beat Kason. I mean, are, are, are you saying? I think you're saying that Chris sucks. You're saying no, I'm that not Parasite saying is bad. That, bro, I'm saying stop instigating. I mean, stop you just said if you you're saying basically it's not Parasite hard, can do it anyway. Okay, how about one? Oh, no, it's sense. not what I'm saying. Stop putting words in my mouth. No, okay, you're instigating now. I need more water. I got it. You're instigating. I need more water. I'll be right back. I, I'm gonna, gonna go. I'm gonna go shred this chicken real quick in the crock pot, and then I'm ready yeah, to go, fucking yeah, play. Yeah, go, go or, shred that shit. I'm gonna shred this shit. Yo, what, what rank are you? I need a fucking. I'm a platinum uh, three, bro. All right, I'm gonna need a burner, bro. Who's got a burner in the chat? You're telling bro? me there's a CDO coach fresh off a win and he's in plat? Yeah, I love rank nine too. I played like four games. I've told nah, you, I don't even watch when the boys play. I'm not even in the dugout. I'm he's been playing casino. Warzone. I don't even watch. Uh, I play Warzone in the casino. <laughs> That's how easy it is to win nowadays. I play Warzone. I take it back, chat. Wars. Is that shit good? What's up? Where's that mobile? mobile? Yeah, I yeah. I'm gonna be honest, with you. you're getting slammed oh, yeah. on 2020. Bro. It's just easy as fuck, bro. It's just as easy. Okay, how about one one though, Tom? One one might be fucking insane. No, no, we can't. No, one one is hard. One one is hard. No, one one is hard. One one is unwinnable. Bro. Actually, think you hit one see. slide and they cannot kill you. <laughs> Let me see this, bro. I'm just holy it one shit. One. How bad? Bro, how bad? Bro, you slide one time and you're not. I'm running shit. I'm running shit right now. I see. I can't even. Oh, you can't turn. Somebody slid at me at Chuck. You can't. You can't. You can't. If someone long slides you, you are dead. But I'm gonna hold my controller to the right. Look, if somebody. I don't got a thousand dollars to put up for this guy. Thousand? You believe in him though, Tom? Sure. Yeah. Is it, this is this. Come Come on, on. What? You think yeah. I got a thousand dollars? You have me or Ben? Wait, what? You have me or Ben in a one-on-one? -on -one. Oh, reset. Uh, I don't know. You're both terrible. Jesus. That's, come on, personally, that question, personally. I'm going Ben Jane to see him. I like that. That's good what? guess. Are you? So, uh, oh so my put god. Put up his bread. Huh? So put up the bread for him. I don't want to. Why do we? I don't got a thousand. Why is it? Why is it How am I gonna get a thousand dollars? Why does the money matter? Like I don't care. Like why? Money, Ben. Money matters here. It's 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 incentivizing me to fucking shit on you. People are still gonna tune in and watch. Like I don't want to tell you. Like it's still gonna. I I don't care if we're playing for one or a thousand. I just don't got a thousand to put up, bro. Like all right. How about okay? How about how about uh? What's a fair number? I don't know. We got time to figure it out. I don't think it's that fucking important, to be honest. A hundred, I'll put the money up. But if uh, Ben wins, I pocket, oh, dude, my, I pocket my, that money. Dude, now. I spilled some water on the Go XLR and everything's fucking uh, up. I'm, I'm down for that, I guess. Uh, I, I, I guess this is a win-win for me. So we, we're doing this on land? I get, I get viewers 